Hey, this is Roner for SubQ Gaming, and today I want to give you guys a look at some high-level gameplay in Call of Duty Heroes. Let's take a look at the leaderboards. Switch over to top players. You can see in monthly ranking I am number one. And in lifetime ranking I am number two, behind iStoned. I managed to find and three-star his base last night, and I caught it all on video. Because there are no replays in this game yet, what you're going to see is real-time gameplay of me taking on iStone Space, the number one player in Call of Duty Heroes right now. The first thing you'll see me do is switch over to Heroes and drop Captain Price, and then immediately go into Chopper Gunner. My goal here is to take out as many defensive weapons as possible. His base is built up pretty well, so I can't get them all in one pass. I'm going to jump back into Chopper Gunner one more time and take another pass, clearing out a few more defensive weapons. The only weapon remaining at this point is a lone SAM turret. What I'm going to do is drop my other hero, Wallcroft, near that weapon and have him attack it. Now I'm going to pepper the main area of the base with Juggernauts. These are high damage units, so they're going to take down the remaining structures pretty easily. Now I'm going to look in the far corners of the base, because as you can see here, people often hide one or two structures out in the corners, hoping that you don't see it and time runs out before your troops get over there and you can get 100%. I've dropped assault troopers at these structures, so they will take them out before the timer runs out. And I still have four dragon fire units on standby, just in case my main troops get taken out by some well-placed mines. The core of my attack squad is now converging on the center of the base. Doesn't look like my dragon fire units are going to be necessary. Consider it done. On my way. Consider it done. The exterior walls have now been breached, and all of my units are converging around the command center. There are only a few structures left to take out, and this is going to be a 3-star, 100% victory on the number one ranked player in Call of Duty Heroes. Please leave any feedback in the comments section, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.